soft hair is very, very beautiful. And makeup and stuff because it can build up and it can be very cakey looking. I've actually seen it a lot of times. I seen it last night on the girl's picture, but I didn't want to say anything because you know you might have to be my vibe about their makeup. They can be really touchy. I have kind of thick eyebrows. Okay, I guess some more light. I found it. I was looking for my eyebrow brush because it's kind of hard for me to do my eyebrows. I'm not really a pro with my eyebrows like that yet. <clears throat> but who is a pro with me? So I'm going to put these eyebrows on. Just kind of, me and my friends were talking. I don't really have that many friends, so this is a very close conversation. And my friends and I kind of felt like that Ariana Grande was like the new age Mariah Carey. But we need to hear some more heartfelt songs first. <laughs> Now, I think this eyebrow is pretty good because I didn't even really need, I don't really need to um, fix it up that much, but I don't like the way that it looks at the bottom. So I'm just going to go through the bottom like this. Okay, here's the hard part. I'm always having a problem getting this one to look like this one. So let's hope it gets done right this time for you guys. What you doing in there, girl? The camera pretty good. I'm actually proud of myself. 
Yeah. You want to say hi to some people? Mm -hmm. Hi. Hi, everybody. Hi, everybody. You got your hair done? So, Barbie, now she has panties. When did she get panties? And she had to get some clothes. Mm -hmm. she, got, she got to get clothes on, too. Here, take them in there. Okay. Okay. No, take them in the living room. <laughs> this is not really my color, but I use it anyway for like a primer to keep my my powder makeup in the place where I need to be. Um, As you can see, I have this down here, and I absolutely hate it. Absolutely hate it. So, I'm gonna go. My daughter always is messing with my makeup, so I never think of that. Unfortunately for me, I'm not Sorry, I always get hype on that part.
I just do that to lighten up around my ear, my eyes. I said my ears. To lighten up around my eyes. I'm honestly trying to play side to side again because I love that song. Now, I know everybody screaming about these beauty blenders or whatever. I don't have no money for no damn beauty blender. So, fuck anybody who got something to say about it. I'm using my little finger. I have a little excess moment. I smoke cigarettes, so I'm gonna rub that around here. I'm not a role model at all. So, <laughs> just put that out there. <laughs> I'm going to go in with my net concealer. I don't know if you what number this is. I found it with a number. So, please buy that. Oh, NC45. I believe. Yeah. I can't lie, this is one of my favorite songs by her as well. I just couldn't imagine Kat from uh, the Nickelodeon show singing like this. And honestly, I was a little caught off guard when her and Big Sean was dating. I'm like... I was a little caught off guard, but hey, whatever. I'm not gonna be fake about it. I do think that him and Jimmy Echo is a better match. See, I did not like how my eyebrow was, um, how this looks, so, uh, Bella Extra, 
I still love the line, just like I did when he made Fireman and all that other shit. Fans ain't fans like how they used to be. Back in the day, fans was really fans. Like, when we was fans of Lil Wayne and, and Lisa K and, and all that type of shit, we were real fans. We were. We were real fucking fans. We were at the concert. We bought the mugs, the t-shirts. We were there. When they got into, when they got into beefs with other artists, we felt like we was in that beef with the other artists. Real fans, fake fans. Well, unfortunately, we're gonna go in with this Maybelline Fit Me Dewy Smooth in the color 315 Soft Honey. I feel like I have a little bit darker than this color, but it's cool. I'm gonna. No. Why don't we listen to her boy, her ex boyfriend, and his new girlfriend? I just gotta use off of here because I can't take it anymore. This is her ex So now, I don't put the, the foundation on. I'm gonna get this into my skin. Put the hand on there. I do not know why. You can't. You really can't. Because you will be looking at 
Well, we gotta have to, we have to get a call this. This white, I'm gonna use this to cover Rebecca and bring back Tiara. Now, I really can't look at y'all when I do this because I got a nice show. It looks to my liking to that black girl back. <laughs> and what I like about this product. This stuff has great coverage. Absolutely great coverage. Now, you know how girls be having that highlight of uh, their eyebrow looking like the guy dang on food. <laughs> looking foolish. They never realize that it only takes two seconds to do like Clearly see that white man's line. You can't see. Actually, let that damn brush touch your eyebrows. You already put that black makeup in there, so it ain't going nowhere. By lying down, and they look natural again. You know that one home girl that you call two days in advance about the party that's going on Friday? You called me on Wednesday. It's just Friday. I still ain't ready. Don't do that. Really sweet. I like it. Now that we got some coverage, it's time to start highlighting. Now I do my highlight with the cream, but I do not contour with the cream. That is no. I don't. Now to each of them, if you like to do that, then that's totally up to you. But I. Yeah. I do not like the, the the extra darkness when I contour with the cream. And when I contour with powder, it's a little bit more easier for me to handle. Oh my god, I can't wait for this to go. And I'm 
lot of people put it on super thick so that it can blend it away. I think because of the fact that I'm using my finger, that I did not have to use a lot. And I can just put it on and blend as I go instead of putting on this heavy ass highlight and then blending it out. I think that is so dumb. It doesn't make any sense. But, by the way, did each its own. Now, I just made these two white lines right here so I know where my contour is going to stop. Now, I'm going to go back in with my NYX Highlighting Contour Palette. And you can get this from Alta Beauty or the Beauty Supply Store. And I'm going to go in with this color right here. Same brush that I just put my whole face on. Same brush. Just two good brushes. I put some on the side right there. This is my first time bringing my contour all the way down to there. I've never brought it, brought it all the way down there. I always normally stop back here. But today, for you guys, let me just go ahead and go the whole way and try something different and see how it comes out on my face. And so far, it's so good. I'm kind of liking how it just chiseled. I <clears throat> said how I just chiseled my head. kind of like that. What the? But you see, you can clearly see that. So, we're going to go in with this. With this powder. It's like a beige. Do it. I'm going to put my little here first. I almost forgot. I'm going to put this up here, like under the eyes. Like that. And I'm going to put a little bit. Here. Now I definitely don't look like the same person that I would that started on this video. <laughs> and to contour my nose, I'm gonna use the same brush, but I'm not gonna go in with that dark brown. I'm gonna go in with this brown right here. And I'm the same thing, sides. Side, get a little, get some on there. And I just contour it from one side of my nose. And I'll I'm not going to lie, doing that with this big ass brush was kind of hard at first. But then I got the hang of it. <clears throat> now we're going to go in with this like, light ass pastel pink color. Oh my god, I'm going on with this. I really do need to feel like it, but I'm like, uh, you're not doing any fucking thing. Okay, my baby daddy's back, so I'm going to close the door. Okay, dokie. Green eggs and chokies. That didn't make any sense. Disregard that. <laughs> the one thing I didn't do, now we're pretty much done because we did all that shit. Now, because we're just doing a subtle look, I normally go and use this, but I think I'm going to use this one for the night. Just because. There's one. There's one. Damn, now I forgot what the fuck I was supposed to be putting this on. Oh, 
God. Like I said, I'm going to be doing some hello editing on this video. Definitely looks better, and I still gotta work on this eyebrow a little bit because this right here is perfect. This one isn't so perfect, but it doesn't look that bad. So whatever. <coughs> roll it in, I'll roll it in. Now I think it's time for us to play our last song for the tutorial, and I'm gonna pick Ben. This was fun, and I definitely cannot wait to do my next one. I'm actually going to do one tonight. <clears throat> I'm going to go in and 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 I'm going
I just call it white trash. And that, here we go. I'm going to go on this down here. I call this, uh, I know, that's not, that's a little too dark. What is this? Go back to that brush. Soften it up a little bit. I'm not really satisfied, so I'm going to go back down with my color carpet. Yeah. But it's dust over some of the uh, white glitter, the white sparkle, white dust, you know. You know how white made me go back over that again. It's funny. I really don't like how light it was, so now I like this a bit better. I'm glad I'm going to just do this to y'all because I'm going to wash it up anyway. Sometimes your uh, eyeliner gets kind of dry. Put a little tongue gash, you never hurt nobody. And I'm really going in with the eyeliner because it's a little too dark, a little too light. Uh, for me, I'm supposed to see it already. No. 
You can't see me like this! Bye, go play. Okay, so I finally got this eyeliner shit on. It's finally went on. I'm gonna have to go buy another one. This is also a mixed product. It's a super skinny marker. I don't really care if that's that so much. I'm gonna put my makeup up there so I can go. I'm gonna have a lot of editing to do last week. I'm gonna go ahead and let that shit dry because that took me forever to do. Oh, you know, when you're dry, put your butt back up in there. You saw that. Now I'm gonna go in here and I'm gonna do these lips. This is the NYX um, Duo Lip. This is the NYX Ombre Lip Duo. Look around the other side and you got your matte, your new matte finish. And I'll stick this right here in the middle. Where all the magic happens. <laughs> I'm acting like that doesn't create no magic. But I don't know. It looks doubtful. Oh, sorry. This is my mix lingerie in the color Baby Doll. Baby Doll. I'm going to stick this right here. The look would not be complete without mascara. I know that, you know that, Costco, whoever the hell, everybody knows that. I'm not going to lie to you. I'm the type of girl where I would put two, three, maybe four coats of mascara. Okay, that's I one. I one, and you can definitely see the difference. Mascara, no mascara. My mom was on the not the news. I can't say the news. She was not on the fucking news. She was at this church event, and she was on TV for this church event. That was cool, whatever, whatever, whatever. But then, my auntie saw her on TV later on that day because it was a live taping. And 
my mom was all the way in Florida. My aunt was in Detroit. My aunt called my mom and was like, you don't have on any mascara. <laughs> oh, MG. And it was like my mom's first time ever going to Florida. So she didn't really know too much of anything. She, um, she, uh, didn't really know where to go or anything. So my aunt decided she's going to call the nearest CVS from Detroit, the nearest CVS to my mom's hotel. And <laughs> she called, and the guy was a security guard or something. He was going to get off work. And my aunt was like, oh my God, sir. My niece is down there. She doesn't know anyone. Could you please drop her off to the messenger? And shockingly, he did. Now, to end this look off and to end this tutorial, and y'all can stop listening to me blah, 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 blah. I'm going to close this out and I'm going to go in on my lips with this NYX Intense Butter Gloss. Um, has three come in pack. It was uh, different colors, but I only grabbed this one because these are more of the colors that I wear on a day to day basis. So, this is for yourself. And yes, these are real NYX, not the fake ones from Japan. Because everybody I know been ordering that stuff from Japan, coming over here trying to sell it, thinking we dumb and don't know what the hell they do. So this color I'm going to put in on my lips to finish off is called Cookie Butter. I like this one. And it smells so good. Mm spray that's like my favorite part of my makeup I promise you and I'm so pissed because I cannot find my eyebrow pencil which is the key essential to my makeup but I have not been able to find my finishing spray and that's another thing I was supposed to go in on my highlight with the the next illuminator, but I'm not going to do that. And I needed my finishing spray, but I don't have that. So, this is a little trick. This is a makeup hack. Don't forget this. If you don't have finishing spray, you can use your primer spray. It may not give you the shimmer shine you wanted from your finishing spray, but definitely it locks your makeup in, it makes your makeup tone down a little bit so it matches your skin complexion a little bit more. So as you can see, I'm going to put my face close to this camera. It's pretty, it's pretty nice, actually, I did a pretty good job. Probably so. That heck. Um, but... But, it's still a little light for me. So I'm going to spray a little of my finishing yeah. Yeah. primer spray, first base primer spray. Just a little bit. I'm going to step away from my computer, but I'm going to time this up a little bit so you can see. Now, I sprayed enough just so I can feel the, the moistness on my face. I didn't feel enough on my eyes, so I need to get a little bit more on my eyes. Now, we are officially done. 
I didn't have any lashes. Like I said, this is my, as y'all saw last night. This, yes, last night was my first video. Today makes my second video. So, it's just going to get better with time. You just got to give me some time. <laughs> and we're going to rock this out the hard way. So now, I'm going to lift my um, my laptop up so everyone can see my finished face and how it looks in the light. And please believe I will be getting a new camera so I can make you guys more videos without having to go through this. But this is fun. I must admit. And this is your finished product after all the products that I used, how I did it, no. I know. I'm turning like this so you can see me. Boom. I'm excited. This was so much freaking fun. And I can't wait to see you guys later on. I'm about to get this video edited. And I'm about to get it uploaded. I'm going to. I don't need to add any music. We got enough music. But um, tonight we're going to have story time before I wash my makeup off. So we're going to have story time. And then I'm going to do another video of me washing this makeup off of my face. Yes. Because I see you guys do makeup tutorials. Hold on. I see y'all do makeup tutorials all the time. You should have how to put on lashes, put on five hundred dollars makeup. But you ain't never showed these bitches how to properly wash this off their face. Yes, so tonight, after story time, we're gonna I'm gonna show you bitches how to wash your face. How to wash this makeup off your face. Because yes, using a makeup wipe is definitely good. Definitely. But that's not the only step. With all of this makeup on your face, especially if you put your makeup on at 8 o'clock in the day and now you're trying to go to work and go to school and go to do all these errands and take care of your kids and your boyfriend and your husband or whatever and your side chick and your side nigga and all this and that, baby, you got way more than just some makeup wiping to do. You have to scrub your face twice after using the damn makeup wipes. So, this was Time with Tawny, Sierra, whatever you guys want to address me by, if you have some looks that you guys want to see me try. If you have looks you guys want to see me try, feel free to comment. Um, I would say leave your negative comments back home, but I'm pretty sure they're going to come. <laughs> and I'm prepared. But I hope you guys have a good night. Enjoy the rest of your night, day, wherever you are in the world. <sighs> We're going to do this for the last time. Still freaking banging. That's it. <laughs> Okie dokie. This is done. I'm done. I am going to go sit down and figure out some things and get to editing this video. So, real talk, real time with Tierra Tani is officially over and 